Ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff Seymour, the historian and curator of the National Civil War Naval Museum, coming at you again with another definition. Uh, I am currently in the middle of our captain's cabin in the Hartford mock-up that we have here in the museum, and the, the definition is, what is a captain? Well, the origin of the word captain apparently comes from Greek, which means the head. Uh, so the person that's at the top, the, the person in command, that is the captain. And uh, traditionally with the naval services, the captain is the, in charge of a ship. So whomever that is. Now this gets to be very complicated because uh, it doesn't matter your actual rank. Uh, if you are in command of a ship, you are the captain. And they make very specific use of this word because there needs to be a clear command structure. They want to make sure that the person in command of a ship is referred to as a captain. So, if you are an ensign, if you are a lieutenant, you are a commander in the modern Navy uh, during the Civil War, uh, if you are in command of a ship, you're the captain. Now, there's also a rank of captain. And this is a higher rank than what you hear of with the army, which leads to more confusion. So with the Navy, if you are in command of a ship, you are the captain. And ladies and gentlemen, come join us. And again, I'm here in the middle of our Hartford exhibit at the National Civil War Naval Museum.